Chapter 856 Alex understood right away that the two elderly people must have some unusual memories of cooking or coming home with him that made them react so awkwardly. Viley also noticed the peculiarity, but he was too embarrassed to point it out, so he turned to Alex and said, Alex, let's go to our suite first. Then, he turned to Nat Arya and said, Mom, you've been on the plane for more than 10 hours, you must be tired. Let's go to the suite and talk if you have something to say to Uncle Richard. Nat Arya suddenly regained her composure. She was thinking about her past with Trump and even recalled the details of their first love-making experience. She blushed shyly and said, Oh, look at me, I'm so absent-minded. Yes, let's go to our suite and talk. Trump echoed hurriedly, Yes, let's go to the suite. It's my fault, once I started talking, I forgot about all of it. Alex shook his head and even sighed helplessly. They were like firewood and raging fire finding each other after two decades. If they were given a chance to bump into each other, there was no doubt that they would create the hottest campfire ever. Taking the lead, Alex escorted everyone to Orem Grand's dining hall. The manager of the food and beverage department was waiting by the door since he received the instruction. He hurriedly marched forward and greeted Alex, Hello sir, are you a member of Orem Grand? Alex shook his head. No, I'm not a member, but I have asked a friend to book a private suite for me. May I have your name please? What is the number of the suite? My name is Alex Anderson, but I'm not sure what the number of the suit is. I booked the suite through your manager, Mr. Smith. The manager bowed graciously and said, Oh, so you are Mr. Anderson. Your suite is ready, please come with me. Alex smiled slightly with a nod and said, Thank you. While the manager led them to the suite, Viley asked curiously, Alex, do you know Mr. Smith? Alex nodded with a polite smile. Yes, but we are just acquaintances. Viley said involuntarily, If I'm not mistaken, Orem Grand is one of Westcliff's Anderson family's properties, and Mr. Smith here is the spokesperson of the family. Alex glanced at Viley in surprise. He didn't expect this UK citizen to know so much about Japan and Oris Hill, so he asked tentatively, Viley, you must have studied a lot about Oris Hill, right? Viley nodded humbly and said, Yes, when I decided to shift the company to Oris Hill, I had studied and understood certain situations here. The company is my father's precious possession, after all, I can't simply shift it into an unfamiliar environment without understanding the local groundwork. Alex gaped in astonishment, Wow, Viley, I'm impressed. You are so meticulous and have such an in-depth foresight. I'm positively sure that you and your company will take off smoothly in Oris Hill and flourish. You're too kind, Alex, Viley donned a polite smile and said. Then, as if something struck his mind, he looked curiously at Alex and asked, Alex, your last name is Anderson, and you know Mr. Smith who works in Orem Grand. Are you from the Anderson family of Westcliff?